students next come let us see what is design modeling so in the previous videos we discussed about the how what is the requirement modeling and what is the analysis modeling so the next stage is the design modeling actually the design model develops overall system architecture develop overall software architecture or a system architecture so it is give complete idea about the software here you are going to design the complete structure of the software which you are going to be developed so that is done in the design modeling so here the structural systems uh, will be divided into subsystems and the design object oriented software architecture uh, actually the first is develop overall software architecture and the structure system into subsystems and a design object oriented software architecture okay so object oriented architecture so i let let me show you uh, just in the diagrammatic form i'll just show you how this design modeling will be used uh, let us take a simple example to explain i said uh, the design model is complete overall system architecture i'll take any one of the system and i'll explain how it is going to be designed let us take here this is uh, one software system a software system which i am taking as a banking system let us take this is a banking system so in the banking system uh, you are having a client a client atm client was there atm client was there okay so this atm client is communicating with it's communicating with uh, a service that is a banking service so this atm client needs to communicate with the banking service and again this atm client is need to communicate with the external user also that is a atm customer and he is also communicates with the external output device that is a cash disperser dispenser the person who is going to place a ca the cash dispenser so this is completely design modeling how uh, you are going to design a system so this overall software architecture here i am designing so based on this uh, in the implementation se section we will implement the what is a cash dispersal role and what the atm ca customer will do and the what is the services for the bank ser banking services like that they have to be designed and the external input output device or the card reader and then uh, receipt printer receipt printer and here the operator external operator so everyone was communicating with the atm client in the banking system so uh, there is a relationship one to one relationship everything here is one to one relationship one atm client can uh, take only one cash this means at a time one to one and here the atm client and the banking service is having one to many and so many clients and only one banking service so many clients can interact with only one banking service so this is a request from re request service from so this is a just atm client is requesting the banking service so this is how you are going to design a software so this is a design modeling so the design modeling it develop overall software architecture so here i am developing a software architecture that is a atm client thank you